just give me an okay then I'll start. Okay guys, by the time you watch this, it's a little too late, but I still have to show you how to get sued up to prepare yourself against virus, coronavirus outbreak in your office or near your office. First of all, you need an N95 mask. Anything would do fine. Then I'm gonna show you how to suit up, how to protect yourself. N95 mask, is it has to be reused, so you have to do it differently, okay? So you, when it's a clean one, you cup it, and you pull the top one over your nose, above your ears, then you hold on to the second part, over your neck. And then what you need to do is then put a regular mask over this N95 mask to protect it, because we only got one, okay? And then you need to buy this at local hardware store, Home Depot. It has to be sealed, okay? So what you do is you need to put yourself over this. And then remember to press this down so it won't fuck up, okay? Then you have to done a suit. Isolation suit. Because we are the most visible and most vulnerable part of the medical professionals. We get a splatter. They don't. So remember that. So suit up like I do. And then, in order to prevent yourself from getting more splatter, there's a face shield anybody could get. If you don't have this, Harbor Fry sells it for $3.99. Okay? Pull it over. And then gloves. Now you're prepared. Okay? You have to be in the suit all day. All right? You're going to take lunch break. Then you have to really spray this, take this off. Spray this area, put it on a clean surface that you've already sprayed, take this off, and then spray it both in and out and under that. And you get the idea? You could get a new mask if you want, but I suggest you spray that too. Save yourself some money. And this one here has to be taken out very carefully so you won't damage it softly. The neck first, gently pull it off your face. All right? And then you want to spray a certain surface to make sure it's clean. This chair is already sprayed, okay? So you have a designated area. Now, in case you have patients who don't have masks and they're panicking, they have regular medical masks, my filtration rate here is 95%. You can make a filtration rate of 80 to 85% by using this. Baby wipe, okay? Two layers of baby wipe, two ply of tissue, you can actually make a very reasonable mask. It uh, looks like this. I give them out to patients. Okay, I sew. Okay, guys? So that's what it looks like. See that? And then you sew in a little 16 gauge wire. Make a nose piece. You can actually use that and it'll filter. It's better than nothing. Okay, and ask them to reuse it. As I said, put it over, take it out carefully on a clean surface. This can be reused. When the time comes, you can change the filter. Spray it on the outside with a little bit of alcohol, okay? Tell your patients that. In case you really have trouble getting all the materials, um, look on YouTube. There are homemade videos how to make your own masks, okay? Anything is better than nothing. CDC is wrong. Everybody should done a one mask per patient, per person, okay? You've got a problem, call me. I'm on YouTube. I'm going to put it on YouTube. I'm on Facebook. Okay, I'm, I'm practicing dentistry in East Orleans, Massachusetts. You can look me up, Benjamin Chung, okay? My office and all that information. You can call the office, ask for more information, okay? And if you have trouble with N95 masks, because nobody, nobody has these, find them on eBay. They're $17 a piece, okay? Get them now before they disappear. The outbreak will be around for another two, probably about two months. It's likely one of your patients could be infected. You have to have a... A precaution like I do. When you've done this mask and the whole thing, you have to wear it all day. Okay? Unless you're taking lunch and all, you got to have a designate place that you spray down that's clean. Don't contaminate that mask. Okay? You've got question? call me. Um, messenger me on Facebook. I can be messengered. Okay? Or call my office. All right? 508-255-1401. My name is Ben Chung. When you see this video, it means that we are in serious trouble. We could be in an outbreak. And your office and office personnel could be in danger. Okay, thank you so much. And spread this video if you need it. Thank you. Bye-bye.